According to Matthew, official international trailer, it's trending right now, and I saw a little bit of the synopsis that said something about an exorcist. Okay, let's uh, take a look. All right, guys. According to Matthew is something that I really know nothing too much about. So it does seem like it's supposed to be a horror film, I think. Let's, uh, let's watch this trailer and find out. been a great help to Randy and me. We really appreciate it. That's what we're here for. I don't think we could ever repay you. But if there is anything, just let me know. Based on a true story, that actress is beautiful, by the way. Very beautiful. You're gonna miss me. Of course. Okay. Uh oh. Don't like that. Oh no. So what? He gets possessed? What does this have to do with an exorcism? That's an evil look. That was an evil player. Amen. Is this something you can do for me? Please. What's going on here? Is there anything you can do? Oh, okay. She's gonna give herself to me. I get it. But the priest shouldn't want that. Corruption. Yeah, you don't like stories like this. I don't like stories like this. Aye. John Wick for men. Okay, well, why are they not talking to me? Alston Coke. Or is it Koch? I don't know. Is this supposed to be blowing my mind? Because it's not. It's a nice shot. So, the guy goes to jail. According to Matthew. According to Matthew. Did that blow me away? No, it did not. Let's read the synopsis here. The true story of a socially popular and powerful Protestant priest of St. Paul's Church in Colombo, Father Matthew, who was also a well-respected and sought-after exorcist, who in the late 1970s conspired with his mistress, oh, okay, to murder his wife and his mistress's husband by poisoning the victims with Gradual overdoses of insulin. Okay, I see what's going on here. So they're they're both bad people. He evaded detection, owning to his standing in the community, and continued fearlessly with nefarious activities. So this is a bad man. This this father guy, this Matthew guy, is a, is a, is a bad man. He's bad. And I guess this woman is, was his mistress, and they do a lot of terrible and disgusting things, according to Matthew. Did I get any of that synopsis in this trailer? That nobody was talking, so it was kind of hard to tell what was going on. It was just about imagery, and I didn't like it. This trailer, for me, would have to get a thumbs down. There's no favorite part of this. The only thing that really stood out to me was that actress, Jacqueline Fernandez. I think uh, she's got a look to her that's probably, you know, a lot of people will like. So... Yeah, let's see more from her, but as far as this movie goes, the subject matter, it doesn't speak to me. It doesn't move me. And that's a shame. Okay, that's it. My name is James, 
and you're watching Mirror Domains. If you like what you've seen, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe.